Okay, so I've done that first bucket separation. Now I've got clean water in my bucket. A couple points that I really want to stress when you're gold panning is if you've got a new gold pan, plastic or whatever, make sure you wash it. Any kind of oils will actually stick to your heavy minerals and float them off the top. Um, if you're going to pan from a bucket, the easiest thing to do is just add a little bit of liquid detergent because like the oils, the um, surficial tension can actually glean to those particles and float them off. So if you add a little bit of soap, you cut that tension and it allows you to keep all your heavies at the bottom, all your lights near the top and pan without worrying about stuff floating away because you'll notice when we get into this that when you, all your heavies get towards the end, if you don't have soap or you have oil, you'll actually see like magnetites and zircons float up on the surface and roll off to the front of the pan. So we want to avoid that. Um, metal pans need to be treated. My favorite are metal pans because when you get a little bit of rust on the pan, it really helps stick to the, it gives a kind of attraction for the zircons. Um, and that's about it. If, if you're pinning in the field and you're sitting in the rock unit, you want to sample, go away or go at it. If you're not, you might want to pan into like a big Tupperware bin. So everything you scrape, you can save and you can redo this to get make sure you get every last heavy mineral you want. And so um, let's get started.